What is happening, everybody? Thank you for clicking into another episode of Device Updates. I am David, your Android junkie over at AndroidSpin.com, and happy Monday to all of you. I know Mondays kind of suck, so hopefully I can bring some happiness to your Monday. We're going to be looking at device updates between the dates of May 6th and the 13th, so let's see if your device is getting an update. The T-Mobile Samsung Galaxy S3 will start getting Android 4.1.2 rolled out to it today. This update includes multi-window, some camera option, NFC-based auto pairing, and a couple other setting modes. Some of you might be familiar with the multi-window that has been shown off in the Galaxy Note line and in the Galaxy S4. Yes, you'll be able to have two apps running at once side by side, which is a nice little feature to have. This update is 168 megabytes in size, so check your system updates. It might already be there. They will be rolling out this update all the way to June 16th. And users can also jump to the Samsung kiosk to download it there. So download it there if you want to or wait for the update to be rolled out to you. And it looks like the AT&T Galaxy S4 got its update. Yes, we saw the Sprint and T-Mobile variants get their updates. Now the AT&T one is getting an update as well. Some have mentioned the camera is much improved and so of course performance has been improved too, but you never know, could be a placebo effect, might just be squashing some bugs there for you. The download is a tiny 21 megabytes in size, so nothing to worry about with like that whole battery thing and make sure on Wi-Fi. Just check your system settings and make sure you get that update. And before it's even made available to the public, Google Glass gets a nice little update that is called the XE5 update. A lot of the tech bloggers out there say this is a much, much needed update for Google Glass. Such features that are coming with this update include Google Plus notifications as well as Hangout notifications. Some people were saying that was much needed for Google Glass, of course. So yes, before it's even made available to the public, just making it better than it already is. So hopefully when it is released to the public, it'll be nice and polished and beautiful and we will all be walking around like Terminators. Well, alright guys, that concludes device updates for this week. There wasn't that many and I apologize if I missed any. Make sure you hit that like thumbs up button if you like this video and make sure you subscribe to the Android Spin channel if you have not already. Well, I am David, your Android junkie over at AndroidSpin.com and this has been Device Updates. Hopefully your device got updated. I'll talk to you guys later.